Heyo! So what is going on guys, it's Triple G here, back with another Borderlands 3 video and in today's video we are going to be talking about what has to be considered the best assault rifle in Borderlands 3 and the great thing is there is no DLC required. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to the channel or join us over on Twitch, we stream five times a week and otherwise, let's get straight into this video. So the No Pew Pew is a legendary assault rifle and it is found from the cartel enemies in Borderlands 3. The good news is that thanks to the free update Gearbox gave us, the Cartels is now a permanent addition to Borderlands 3 and therefore you can farm for the No Pew Pew without any worry at all of you running out of time. The No Pew Pew is manufactured by CLV and is defaulted to Incendiary, comes in a x3, x4 and a x5 variant with the x3 probably being the most optimum for DPS. Being CLV the weapon overheats from time to time but that should not put you off. This thing is an absolute beast. It can drop from any of the following named cartel bosses, Roaster, the Tenderizer, or actually Joey himself. The No Pew Pew's legendary ability is that upon killing an enemy, it will spawn a lava pool underneath the corpse of said enemy that you have just killed for three seconds. That will also do incendiary damage. The weapon is great on virtually all characters, but my personal favorite is when you put it in the hands of the clone, because it gets that mayhem scaling and absolutely smacks. Its rivals, the OPQ and the Monarch, are still exceptional options when it comes to Borderlands 3, but the No Pew Pew, in my opinion, just shades it and takes the crown of the king of the assault rivals in Borderlands 3. Guys, if you've enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to the channel or join us over on Twitch. We stream five times a week, and otherwise, I'll catch you on the flip.